Oh, 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 oh. I figure I'd start y'all off with a nice little montage of my awesomeness in this game. Y'all like these interviews, or would you like to see one of those professional interviews? I mean, not interviews, intros. Would you like to see these type of intros? Because these take a while to dice up all this stuff. Uh, hold on, I'll talk to you about it in a minute. Let's get the show started. What's up, YouTube? Not having it in the Game Caviar Studio. I'm bringing you some Gotham City Imposters gameplay online. This is a uh, weird match. It's a team death match, but uh, half of our enemy team fell out of the match. And I've noticed that this happens a lot in this game. So uh, we just went ahead and rolled, uh, rolled along. We just went ahead with it. And what happens is you don't really, I know for me, I don't really see this happening as it happens. But after a while, you'll end up running around the match and not seeing many enemies. And I know for me, that's when I check the score and notice that most of the team is gone. So what I do is it, it got so bad that we end up, we didn't even finish the match. The match got cut off. So I had to uh, be a little creative and add a, <laughs> I, I had to, I, you'll see how I finished the video. It's kind of, it's kind of cheesy, but it's kind of cool at the same time as I almost blew myself up. I like this little rocket launcher they have right here. Um, I got, I, man, I kept getting killed by that guy right there with the damn sniper rifle. And it was, it was really pissing me off. I'm, I'm really becoming more and more against, get the prize box, more and more against sniper rifles in video games like this. I believe they should have their own little section just for people who want to snipe because it hurts the whole flow of the game. And I don't know. Maybe I, I don't know. I don't know. But anyway, like I was saying in the beginning, do you guys, would you guys rather the videos that uh, I put up have one of those custom intros to where it's a game and you see some some awesomeness or would you rather see some sort of uh really cool uh, professionally made intro like a lot of youtube channels have uh, i don't mind doing either one but the uh the the custom intros like the mini montages that you see they take a little bit of time to put together but at the same time, they're custom, so you don't have to worry about anybody else having the same exact one. Uh, I don't, I've really, I haven't seen anybody professional, like big name channels do something like this. Uh, I know some some people do, like Chris Move does that, to where he has like a, uh, a, a, sometimes he has a gameplay intro type before he gets into his main uh, gameplay. So, uh, I don't know. What do you guys think? Would you rather see the custom mini Taj or would you rather see a professionally made, you know, somebody went on and made it specifically for our channel? I'm cool with either one, but I just wanted to see what you guys thought. Uh, um, wow. Another thing, um, we're still pushing to get partner in 2012. So if you could, if you're watching this video and haven't subbed, please go ahead and uh, subscribe to the channel. We have a lot of good content. We update regularly and you'll be very uh, surprised and entertained at the videos that we put up. So please, if you could take some time right now to subscribe to the channel, it's free and we appreciate every one of us subscribers. Uh, we, we got a bunch of subscribers this past week and uh, I, I personally appreciate every single last one of the subscribers that we have. And I know JB's and C thought they feel the same way. So, right here is the halfway point in the match where, um, now nah, there's still a lot of people. Uh, maybe I was thinking of a, a different match, but anyway, the matchmaking in this game is kind of flaky, and I believe they're going to come up with some sort of uh, update pretty soon to take care of that. But what happens is, sometimes you would go through a match and most of the team and i doubt they're all rage quitting because this game really doesn't make you rage quit that much and I, in my case it doesn't it's just a really fun game to play but from what i gather a lot of times people just drop out of the match for whatever reason and it doesn't it it happened to me at the end of this match that was the first time that i just got disconnected from a match maybe the host um left i don't know whether it's uh, whether they have dedicated servers or whether it's like a peer-to-peer -peer thing but um 
yeah, you'll just be playing a match and half your team will be gone or or half of the enemy team will, will just disconnect and be and leave and you won't get I, I know in my case we don't get like, nobody else connects you, you see what I'm saying because I don't think this game has it to where you get you where you can join the game in progress it's always a game that that's almost um, about to start or or a new lobby so uh keep an eye out for that if you have this game other than that this game is just as fun as it was in the beta if you can remember a couple videos ago i added a beta video of when it first came out and i was going through my first impressions of the game and those first impressions are still the same i mean it's pretty cool they're supposed to add uh, downloadable content for new maps which i would love because they don't have enough maps but i like everything else about this game sometimes it's kind of it's not really laggy the matchmaking is the biggest issue hopefully they uh they they handle that in the next update or update soon i'm using this uh, uh this big gun this uh, large machine gun it's lmg and it really it slows you down but because of my the size of my character uh, it doesn't really affect me that much and I have the perk that makes you move around faster One thing I don't like is the fact that the bigger character that you have the more damage that you can take But you move slower and it's a trade-off of you, you can take more damage and speed or whatever I don't like that I think everybody should have the same amount of health and the look of your character should be just just that just the look It shouldn't affect your health or movement. I like it. I mean, it's it's more I guess you could say it's more realistic it's different it's a different take on on first person shooters but it, it gets in the way a lot so I, I don't like it but I have to deal with it other than that the game is amazing the weapons are fun they're fun to play the game modes are fun and it's very innovative and different a lot of people don't like it because it's gotham city and batman doesn't use guns and they don't understand the concept of this game but if you really look at it it's just a game it's just a first person shooter so play it and have fun anyway we're coming up at the end of the match where we get disconnected and and since we got disconnected i didn't just want to end the video so i had to splice in a final kill from call of duty black ops <laughs> just so i can give this video a proper ending so like comment subscribe spread the word i'm not having it in the game caviar studio hit me up and let you know what type of intro you would like to see on our videos so we could go ahead and accommodate that for you um thanks for viewing the video and i'm out game, game caviar, caviar.